So joining us live from Elk Grove with the final look. Okay, Erica, let's have it. All right. I think I need to stop now because I'm starting to get like arthritis. <laughs> <laughs> Her time. hand's cramping. Oh, my hand is so painful. This is actually really, really, I mean, it looks hard, but it's not that hard when you have a master next to you kind of guiding you through. I'm not going to lie, he's helped me a lot during this whole process, <laughs> and he's still finishing up his. This takes him about two hours, and look at the detail on this. His, I was saying, his looks like an actual human being because you could see the detail, whereas mine is like <laughs> it kind of fell and molded to a human being, sort of. It's just a slight imprint. And so, Paul, you actually have a blog with all these YouTube videos on it so that people could actually try this at home. Yes. Um, it is It's not as hard as it seems or as it looks. Um, it's just a matter of people giving it a try, and as you can see, you know, with a little bit of help, you, you, you know, you got something there. I'm proud of you. I'm actually jealous of your uh, pumpkin. <laughs> He's been complaining all, like, all morning that I have the better pumpkin because it has a little bit more meat on it. But so that's just, that's one of the tips that you want to pick the right pumpkin. Yeah. And then when you carve, wow. um, give Look us a few these. tips on how to get started. Incredible. Well, the first thing I would uh, say was is to get some uh, good tools. And um, if you go to Amazon and stuff, you can look at these uh, clay carving tools. And, and they're simple and cheap to, to get. And once you have this, it's just a matter of kind of picturing, picking up a pumpkin. Don't think about uh, what, oh, I want to carve whatever and then try to get it because that's when you'll get discouraged go for it you think of a face just put it on there and then change it as you go as you saw there i mean <laughs> i like your pumpkin i really do so i mean and if you do something like that you get encouraged to do more and more and as you go on you'll get more creative and be better i mean i don't do nothing special it just takes patience and time Patience, a lot of patience. I think mine kind of looks like Chucky, though. But maybe I can turn it and um, <laughs> enter it into that contest with FC Republic. Maybe I'll do pretty good. Uh, you what know, you Erica, I, I think you've done a fantastic job. I, I think Halisa actually wants some pointers from you. Great work out there. Okay, I'll, I'll, t I'll bring this one home. Yes, bring it home. We need to have it on set <laughs> with us. All right, Erica So in Elk Grove this morning. Thank you so.